backlash of criticism and dismissal. I applaud their actions in demonstrating that, although we are well on our way to becoming the leaders of tomorrow, we can also be the leaders of today, raising our concerns and initiating real change in the present. But it is not enough to only demand that our voices be heard, for this alone does not change others' negative views of our relative and experience in life. That is where the second half of the verse comes in. But be a pattern to the believers in word, in conduct, in love, in faith, in purity. We can and should be patterns to those around us, whether older or younger. What does this mean in our daily lives? It means using respectful language in all our communication, avoiding name-calling and insults while carefully listening to others' viewpoints. It means living a proper and genuine life, behaving consistently with your beliefs and values while admitting your faults and working to improve on them. It means showing genuine care and concern for others, treating all with kindness while striving to understand and empathize with each one's situation. It means staying true to your beliefs and values while respecting those of others and being willing to hold open dialogue about them. It means making wise decisions while refraining from participating in activities that could damage you and your reputation. If we all would dedicate ourselves to living such a life of integrity and compassion, to leading by example, even in the smallest of matters, oh, what a positive difference that will make. We will be a beacon of hope to those who came before and an inspiration to those who are coming after. Not only will our honorable character magnify the impact of our actions, both in the present and in the future, but it will also issue in a more fulfilling life, full of meaning and satisfaction. In closing, I'd like to thank all the patterns who have helped us become the people we are today. Parents, families, and friends, thank you for supporting us all the way, loving us unconditionally through our ups and downs. Teachers, staff members, and administrators, thank you for enriching, us, enriching our lives, imparting to us not only academic knowledge, but also inspiring life lessons. Counselors, thank you for being there at our best and at our worst, guiding us through our search for a path in life. Coaches and mentors, thank you for always pushing us to be our best. Finally, I'd like to thank God, who made it possible that I could share this with you tonight. As we fill the parting glass to North Attleboro High School and gaze ahead to the vast opportunities before us, let us turn the fire ignited within us through our hard work in the last four years into a torch shining to lead others forward in our footsteps. Thank you and congratulations to the class of 2018. Thank you, Mariah. Each year, the members of the graduating class of North Attleboro High School leave behind a gift. This gift serves as an ongoing reminder of the contribution of this class. Please join me in welcoming the North Ottawa High School Class of 2018 Treasurer, Leah Marceau, to present the class gift. Good evening, everybody. The Class of 2018 would like to be remembered as the class committed to the improvement of the aesthetic value and appearance of NAHS. On behalf of our entire school and our intention for our legacy to be that our class paved the way, for the creation of a more welcoming and inclusive environment for all members of our school community, we donated funds for the creation of a large north sign located in our main office. It is with this sign that we help our school take a step towards the creation of a school environment where all members of our school feel welcomed and wanted at all times by all people within our school community. It is our hope that these signs and all other aesthetic improvements will create feelings of pride and belonging for all, school, all students in our school. As this sentiment grows, our class has left behind additional funds for, to support ongoing work within the school building and on campus to improve the physical environment and the level of emotional connection to this great school. Thank you. Thank you, Class Treasurer Marceau. Another great tradition in North Attleboro High School is the part of this ceremony when our senior class shares their class motto. 